Hey, what's up, y'all? Uh, just another day in the tent. Today is day 31 of this grow, and uh, if you're new here, this is my grow diary. I'm just growing some autoflowers in about a 2.7 by 2.7 foot uh, grow space, pretty small. Uh, and uh, all the grow equipment's down in the description. I've been recording every single day, so check out the whole playlist. Um, but anyways, it's gonna be a short video. I'll just go ahead and turn it on the camera. We can jump right into it. So, I've had a really busy day today, and uh, to be honest with y'all, I haven't even popped in the tent one time. So you can see it's like 11 p.m. now. I finally got around to changing the clock over. Um, but yeah, it's super late. Um, the plants are pretty tired. I haven't adjusted LST. I haven't uh, tucked any fan leaves at all. But as you can see, we've got some pre-flower going on. Um, and uh, yeah, we've got some plant vendors that have fallen off. Uh, I'll probably try to pop some of those back on, but um, yeah, I mean, not gonna do a whole lot of work in here today because it's it's so late and uh, I've got more work to do tomorrow. So um, yeah, yeah, uh, it's been an awesome day for me though. Even though I haven't made it in here, I feel like I had a super productive day, got, got a lot of work done. It was just uh, one of those high efficiency days. So. Um, if y'all are workers, you know what I'm talking about uh, when I say that. So anyways, uh, I'll just get some close-ups of the plants. We will uh, check the soil and see if we notice anything new. So still have a pretty aggressive bend right there on that main top. I don't know if y'all can see, but you should be able to right there. If I go from the side, you can see pretty steep. So I think this hubba bubba haze is looking awesome. Uh, yeah, I feel like every time I open up the tent, actually, I get more and more impressed with this plant. So I'll probably just tuck fan leaves. I don't see anything crazy that I need to adjust LST-wise. I mean, I could bend down some of these, but now that I've got those, that pre-flower kind of going on on the tops, I don't want to do too much because I won't get so much more growth out of the lower nodes. And honestly, I say that, and it's not 100% true. Usually I continue LST like all the way through flowering since with the plant benders, it's so easy. But what I mean when I say that is that I'm going to be more careful about um, where I place the benders. So I don't know if I have a good example, uh, but here on this one, you can kind of see that it was almost right up there on top of where the pre-flower would be. Obviously it's fallen off now, so it's just holding onto the leaf. Um, but I'm gonna try to avoid doing that type of thing uh, kind of from here on out. And instead I'll just have it on the stem only uh, because uh, yeah, yeah, I don't want to add too much pressure here. I don't really know if it does anything to be honest with y'all But uh, typically once we get into showing the pre-flower uh, Especially with this plant um, I don't like to uh, mess with the pistols too much. So Yeah, uh, so that's a little bit of uh, The update I'll just go ahead and start checking soil so I don't uh, take forever to finish up this video um and uh, I think I'm feeling some moisture. Hold on, let me get another. Yeah, I'm feeling a little bit of moisture there, but you know, thinking back, it's been a few days since I watered now, I believe. So coming up on a watering here before too long, maybe tomorrow, maybe the day after that. Um, we'll have to see what these other plants are saying. There's still a little bit of moisture in there, but not a whole lot to be honest with y'all. So we'll have to check and see tomorrow. It might actually be tomorrow that is the day. But yeah, in this one, there's hardly any moisture in there, two knuckles deep. So, yeah, probably will have to water the plants tomorrow, uh, but y'all will see that in the next video. So, like I said, I'm just going to adjust some plant benders, nothing too crazy, mostly tucking fan leaves today. And uh, yeah, I mean, I'll refill my humidifier like usual. I'll measure the light height, make sure that we're still within that, like, around 24 inches threshold uh, and yeah nothing crazy today pretty short update I should go ahead and make sure that I get some good close-ups because I don't know if I did that already <laughs> to be honest with y'all a little bit spacey since uh since I just finished working and I literally just got out of the shower so I'm just now starting uh starting to wind down for the evening but that's that cosmic queen here's the uh hubba bubba haze Man, this plant looks good. Pretty excited to see what happens next. I'm not gonna lie. Looking sweet. And the Wookiee Special. Also looking pretty good. I think the Hubba Bubba Haze is a little bit ahead of this one though, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, 
obviously not in the pre-flower development, but uh, but it definitely is as far as uh, the bushiness and like horizontal growth goes. So we'll just have to see which one's the bigger plant uh, in the end. So yeah, let me know what y'all think. Uh, I'd love to hear from y'all in the comments, and as always, you know, I'm no expert at this, so if you guys see something I'm doing wrong, or if you just want to give me some advice, or or let me know that, that hey, you're doing that wrong, even if you don't know the right way to do it, let me know in the comments. I want to hear from y'all, and uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, as always, hope you're having a great day, and if you're not, then make it one, because that's on you, and uh, make sure to smile and share that with somebody, alright? Okay, peace out, y'all.